this to Facebook Live, Facebook Live. We have arrived one more time. Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom on this. What's the day? The 10th? 10th. 10th. July 10th, 2021. I'm excited about the most high on the day. Thank everybody in attendance. Kobe to be and my son Neil and Big Her. Frank in the building, hey. Al Hawk in the place to be, oh, Cam the in the house. We got Myers uh, Jr. in here, so I know Visha in the wing somewhere. Oh. We got Gene Man um, in the house, uh, praying for him. And uh, as y'all chime in, feel free. Okay, I, I switched to the phone, you know, to try to get a stronger internet signal. And it's still freezing. Pray this all fair. Y'all feel free to push the share button. Uh, Johanna, Johanna hey. in the building. What's up, niece? Thank you, Good sir. to see Thank you me. all. Are we praying for the baby? We're praying for the baby that uh, speedy recovery. Yeah. We're praying for uh, Yamina Yahoo for a speedy recovery. Hallelujah. Um, you know, as well, as well, times, times are a little weird, y'all, mm -hmm. you gotta know, you know, you gotta know what time it is, by the Yahoo dogs in the building, hey. yeah, yeah, you, you gotta know what time it is, uh -huh. you know, I know that, uh, Johanna, yeah, 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 but, uh, times we living in, uh, you, gotta, you gotta know what's important, you gotta know what's important, and, and, you, and, and you gotta be steadfast and unmovable, always abounding, uh, no, 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 he's gonna reward you, ain't no vanity in serving him, uh, all this vanity and other stuff, it ain't no Ain't no uh, vanity in, in, in serving him. Let, let's pray, y'all. Let's start off with prayer. Spirit of the Most High, we love you and thank you for this opportunity to come before you. Humbly know how uh, we're gleaning, in, 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 we're, we're set to glean in your word, in your presence. Uh, send that, that relevant word and we may continue to grow in you, be exalted in you, um, for, for, for we need you desperately. Open up doors, let me close, close doors of the contrary to us. Let the man, man open and, and keep us in these um, a, a trying times. Again, we love you and we're casting our cares upon you, knowing that you care. Uh, give us, give us, give us a mind uh, to uh, to be submissive and obedient to you as you lead us to the victory. We trust you and thank you in the match name you. Who should we humbly pray? Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Well, I hope y'all excited and y'all, we ready to get in the book. With no further ado. Let's dive on. Let's dive on in this word, y'all. Let, let's go to uh Matiyahu 6. Um Matiyahu 6. It's a it's a uh a familiar scripture, but it's just it's paramount right now. Excuse me. So let's deal with it. I'm gonna try to get this. It's real simple. I mean, ain't no, ain't no rocket science to this. It's just the average person ain't doing it, but ain't no rocket science to it. So let's talk about it. Here we go. Uh, Yahu six, beginning at twenty four first. Um, before I do that, y'all keep that. I do want to go to Isaiah 65. I just want to show y'all this because this is going to help me teach you. It's going to add a perspective to what I'm going to show you. So, so let's go Isaiah 65 and 11. I just want to show y'all that. Isaiah 65 and 11. This is a perspective. Now, 
it'd be great if I had someone that had the NIV because that's really what I want to show you in the NIV. And I don't have the NIV in front of me right now, yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. I was going to read off that. That's what I was going to say. Uh, uh, why don't you read it for me? Uh, read, read it loud. You, you, you got the NIV? Yeah. No, I really want it to amplify. You got the amplify. Go to amplify. Give me amplify better. Yeah, go to amplify. Give me the amplify. Somebody give me sixty-five eleven in the amplify. Let me see what it says in the in the in the in the, in the KJV. In the KJV, look what it says. It says sixty-five eleven. One one, y'all go to NIV. One one one. You. I got amplify. You got amplify. You got you go back to NIV, Dave. Yeah, yeah, and I'm and I'm gonna read it out of the KJV. Look what this say, because I want y'all to understand this. Sixty-five what verse? Eleven. Sixty-five and eleven. And look, 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 the most high is, 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 is fussing at Yasharel, talking about killing them. And look why he talking about killing them. Look what this say. Isaiah 65 and 11. Look what this say. It says, but ye are they that forsook Yahuwah, that forgot my holy mountain, that prepared a table for that troop, and that furnished the drink offering unto that number. Therefore, will I num will I number you to the sword? That means I'm gonna kill you, and ye shall all bow down to the slaughter, because when I called, you did not answer; when I spake, you did not hear. But did evil, but did evil before in mine eyes, and did choose that wherein I delighted not. So the choice was the wrong choice. Read that real loud for me in the uh, Amplified. Look what that say. Isaiah 65 and 11 reads, But you who abandoned, turned away from the Most High, who forgot and ignored his, his holy mountain, Zion, who set a table for Gad, the Babylonian God of fortune. Start right there. The what? Babylonian God. God of fortune. Did you know that in Hebrew, G-A-D, the phonics on it is G-A-W-D, which is pronounced God. Mm -hmm. it, we be saying Gad, but 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 the Babylonian deity. Read that again. The, the God part too, but pronounce it appropriately. Okay. Who set a table for God, the Babylonian God or deity of fortune. See, the Babylonian deity of fortune name is God. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Spelled uh, G-A-D, but the phonics pronunciation is God. Mm -hmm. Right? And you notice on money, it says in God we trust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And on the money, it has the pyramid. Make it, wow. Make it, it has the pyramid, which Babylon, the Egyptian, the Egyptian, uh, religion is based from Babylonia. Exactly. It's the, exactly the same thing, just renamed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And there is a deity named God, mm -hmm. and it's the God of fortune. Mm -hmm. And money represents fortune. Correct. Mm -hmm. And it has the symbols on the back of the money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it says in God we trust. And we always thought that it was talking about uh, God. So th that's one of the reasons why I'm not too fond of the term God because it's really a name. If y'all looked up the phonics on G-A-D you or, or G-O-D, however you want to say it, but if you looked up the phonics pronunciation of G-A-D, it's really G-A-W-D, which is God. Mm -hmm. And in English, you would spell it G-O-D. Correct. Mm -hmm. and, he, and in Hebrew, you would spell it G-A-D, and both of them is pronounced God. Oh, I just wanted to show you that. I just wanted to show you. And the Most High said, because you just set a table, you just set up worship, you just set up worship for God, which which re represents uh, fortune, money. Yeah, yeah. Fo fo folks, folks chose money or the God of this world over the Elohim of all creation. I, I just wanted to get yeah. that straight. Tell the truth. I, I just wanted to get that straight. So in the 12th verse, he said, oh, I'm going to kill you. Oh, check this out. 
Listen, come on. Continue 11. About many, huh? Go, uh-huh, go on and read. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And who filled a jug of mixed wine for many, the God of fate. Here we go again. That's why I don't believe in luck and all right. that. Because if you get deep into word terms and all that, that destiny, uh, 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 fate, luck, and all that, we don't we don't mess with nothing of that. No, no, no. We 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 roll with Yah. And then many will represent the moon god. To be honest, if we get deeper, I'm not going to go that deep. And, and, and the Babylonian god that came from Nimrod, which represents the sun god worship. And that, and, and that we, we're dealing with the origin of all these things. But I just wanted to lay that foundation a little bit. Now let's go to uh, uh, Mattiahu Matthews, right? 6, 24. I, I just wanted to lay a foundation, y'all. <clears throat> so we can understand better on what we're dealing with. Come on, talk back to me today. Battle, good to see you all. Y'all push the share button and get your tag game going. Look, those of you got a tag game, Matthews. get your tag game going. Matty Yahoo, yep, mother. 6.24, Matthews. 6.24, look what they say, y'all. It says, um, it says that uh, no man can serve two masters. For either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will hold to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve Yah and Mammon. And how we know that Mammon, well, was he a brother of Zeus? I don't know if y'all knew that. Remember, uh, I used to, the Thundercats? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Mammon was in there. That, that, he's he's an underlord. He he, he 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 represents money. I don't want to get all that mixed up because all this stuff is so relevant. But but Mammon is a, a a Greek mythology god, right? And 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 it represents money. Y'all look that up. Y'all look it up. Mammon, look it up. Y'all do your own studies. But anyway. Mammon represents fortune. Same Babylonian deity, Greek mythology, all that stuff has an origin. It goes back to Mesopotamia, Semiramis, and, 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 and the original trinity, Semiramis, Nimrod, and Tammuz. That's why December 24th is Tammuz's birthday. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, what the, that's the origin of the trinity. Most High ain't never taught no, no three. It's always been one. And that's where Nimrod got it from, the Trinity, uh, 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 coming from uh, Mesopotamia, coming from the Tower of Babel in those days. I'm not finna go that deep. So let, 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 let's get off that. I, I, I just want to move forward, but I'm just laying some foundation for you, uh, uh, you know, so y'all can, so y'all can um, do some studying. But at least the word is saying that you can't serve uh, the Most High and Mammon. You can't serve... Most high and money. Get, get what it's saying, right? So here we go. It says, no man can serve two masters, right? For either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will hold to the one and despise the other, so you cannot serve your money. So let me draw the picture then. People literally believe that they lightweight can serve two and if you look at how the Bible classifies it, right, he separates the two and call them both masters. That's him. That's him, yeah. <laughs> was I telling the truth? You was. You found me, <laughs> but, 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 but let me teach y'all. Let me teach. But, but listen, Mammon, listen, he, he classifies money as a master. And he classifies Yah as a master. And he say you can't serve two masters. Listen. People, you can't serve both. Yeah. Because money answers in all things when it comes to natural things. You can get a lot done with money. I'm telling you that now. Yeah, the love of money is the root of all evil. When you love it, it becomes your master. And master, and and, and money is, uh, love is an action word. 
is what you do concerning it. Yeah. Just like loving Yah is an action word. Folks love to love him with their mouth. But, but loving him for real is an action word. And both money and Yah command actions. And there'll be a war. Your actions will be a war with one another. Either you will be in high pursuit of on a paper chase, trying to make it in this world, or you're going to be in a high pursuit over the kingdom of the most high. I just want to draw the picture right like the scriptures is teaching. Uh, uh, Charmaine Yahoo, good to see you on. But look, let's do it. I just want to go further this time. Listen. It says, for no man can serve two masters. For either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will hold to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve Yah and Mammon. Therefore, I say unto you, take no thought for your life. Look at, look, 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 look at how he's breaking it down. He lets you know there's two masters and he's letting you know through these scriptures how to escape the master you should escape, right? This is the mindset that one has to have. Look what it's saying. It said, therefore, because of that, you can't serve both. So because of that, it says, uh, therefore, I say unto you, take no thought uh, for your life, what you shall eat, or what you shall drink, nor yet for your body. What you shall put on is not the life more than the meat and the body more than the clothes or the raiment. Behold, the fowls of the air. Be behold, behold, the fowls of the air, for they sow not, meaning they, don't, they ain't got a job, right? Mm -hmm. Neither do they reap, nor gather in the barns, yet your heavenly Father feedeth them. Are you not much better than they? Which of you, by taking thought, can add one cubit unto a statue? And why take ye thought for a, 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 a raiment? Consider the lily of the field, how they grow, and they toil not, neither do they spin. And yet I say unto you that even Solomon in his glory was not arrayed or clothed or dressed like one of these. Wherefore, if Yah so clothed the grass of the field, which is which is today and tomorrow is cast into an oven, shall he not much more clothe you, O ye of little faith? Therefore take no thought, saying, What shall we eat, or what shall we drink, or wherewithal shall we be clothed? For, for, for after these things do the Gentiles seek. But your heavenly Father knoweth that you have need of all these things. He know what you need. Listen, he know what you need. Watch this. But first seek ye the kingdom of Yah and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Take therefore no thought for tomorrow, for tomorrow shall take thought for the things of itself. Sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. Now I'm ready to teach. Now I'm ready to teach. I'm ready to talk. Um, if, if, if we only knew, right, if we, if we, if we, if we only knew, right, on what's really going on. See, the power of the Prince of the Air is, um, Satan's ability to communicate with people. And through his communication, he influences one of his aces in the hole, in the hole is, you know, he uses fear. This is what he's using in the times we're living in right now because he's turning up the heat. But even prior to, 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 to fear, he uses manipulation, right? And he would have people to believe that life is about something that is totally not about. He has deceive the world in believing that life is about money and prospering and coming up. And then he set the platform by any means necessary. By any means necessary. Folks, it's on a paper chase. Somebody need to mute their phone. Somebody need to mute their phone, please, so others can hear as well on the conference line, please. But listen, he has convinced people that 
Life is about a paper chase and things that one would acquire. But what he didn't explain is that life is like a vapor of smoke, right? The Bible describes life like a vapor of smoke that appear for a moment and vanish away. And the reason why it's like that is because of sin. Because people are wicked and the wages of sin is death. Devil don't want you to look at it like that. The devil wants you to try to achieve even though you were born in sin and shaped in iniquity. He'll cloud your mind and your thoughts, right? He'll cloud your, he'll cloud your mind and your thoughts, right? And have you uh, misappropriating your time and your goals, right? Chasing and trying to be successful. Bible talks about a uh, 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 yalliness is not gain. But folks like to measure their relationship with Yah based on the things they possess. And that's so not it. Because you got people that have the stuff, they're the most wicked people on planet Earth. They're the most selfish people on planet Earth. They're the most demonic people on the face of the earth. You're talking about a murderer. They, they, they don't mind putting a, a murderer from the block in jail. Right. Hey, they kill whole continents. They kill whole countries. They kill millions and millions of people. And they setting up now to kill billions of people. Literally. Yet, yet they have a system in place that will put a, a guy that killed his neighbor. Boyfriend that killed his girlfriend. And then plaster them like they so evil. And mind you, that's evil to kill. Yeah, the Bible goes against that. But we're talking about straight slaughtering Way worse than a serial killer. Serial killer has nothing on these people. Nothing on them or their medical system. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and, and so what the devil did what was, was have people looking at the wrong thing and chasing the wrong th thing. Had, had we understood that we were born in sin and shaped in iniquity, had the schools taught us about Yah, the creator, and the state of humanity, we wouldn't be in this mess. Right. But because the people that's running the world are, 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 are Luciferians, are satanic folk, they got you going to school to, 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 to so-called come up. They got you going to school actually to be their slave and to limit your come up. So, so they can put a ceiling and a cap on you so you can never reach them so they can continue to run the world. But at the end of the day, they got you believing that you should be after the lifestyles of the rich and famous. Yeah. And then when you reach a certain level of success, then you get to meet them personally. Then they want to bring you into the inner circle. Yeah, they, 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 they want to sleep with you. They want to sleep with the men. They want to, they want to, they want to, they want to, what do you call it? Bronco breaking, bronco yeah. busting, but, 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 but busting, but, 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 bucking, buck, bucking your butt buster. So they, they want to get you, they, they, they want you to end up with one eye. One, to, they want to initiate you into their program. Mm -hmm. They want your wife and your children sexually. Yeah, they, 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 they run through you because they're Luciferians and they're satanic. But let me deal with the deception that they got going. The power of the prince of the air. Listen. The power of the prince of the air is, 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 is manipulating people and causing them to seek wealth and things. Though they're pedophiles. I'm not even talking about them now. I'm talking about the people. <laughs> but they're pedophiles. They're adulterers. They're fornicators. They're, they're yah haters. They're selfish. They're stingy. They're envious. But they're not worried about that because that's not what's being marketed and promoted. That's not what's being taught. The, the Luciferian doctrine of do what thou wilt is being taught. Can't nobody tell me nothing is being taught. Women's lib is being taught. 
the mascul the masculinization of the women going against Yah. The, 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 the feminizing of the men going against Yah. Call, 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 switching everything. Per perverting everything. That's what they're doing. They're paving the way for their God, which is Lucifer. Uh huh. And, and, and so they, they, they want the people, here we go with the doctrine of Balaam again. Because the doctrine of Balaam, especially when it deals with the children of Yashorel, how, how they got them was uh, uh, Yah wouldn't curse them. So, 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 so what Balaam taught Balak was get them to sin, get them to go in and start sleeping with the daughters of Ammon, get them to sin, and, and then Yah got to curse them, Yah got to punish them. And so now you got the power of the prince of the air that's promoting and marketing everything that goes against Yah. And then he's distracting people and giving them uh, 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 in this vapor of a life, this short lifespan, giving them goals that go against Yah, causing them not to look on the Yahushua, who's the author and finisher of their faith, but they're looking on to, on to money. They're, they're looking on to Buffett in them. They're looking on to Bill Gates in them. They're looking on to the Rothschild money. And for, for, for the Hebrews, they gave you Scarface and, and Truck Turner and Coffee and the Mac. Got you looking at pips. They didn't got in your music. Want, 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 want to glorify killing one another. And, and, and the world is mine with fat gold donkey ropes. They, 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 they don't want you to sing about Yah and life and come together and prosperity. They had that meeting. They had that meeting in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. How we gonna take over the music and, and cause Yasharel uh, not only to continue to forget who they are, so they won't know who they are, but we are gonna use the music to destroy them. Because here we go with the power of the Prince of the Air. Right. The power is influence, and they're influencing you, right? So when you look at the word, right, and you look at uh, Israel, Israel, Yashorel got themselves in a situation where they were uh, worshiping the, God, the Babylonian god called God. <laughs> that was his name. Yeah. And, 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 and what God was was a deity of fortune on a paper chase, trying to acquire things as opposed to acquiring the true necessary relationship with the Most High. Well, the Most High concluded in Isaiah 65 and 11, because of that, I'm going to destroy you. Listen. Now, let's, let, let's perpetrate uh, all the way down to where we are now. So it's established, right, that you can't serve both Yah and money, and he classified both of them as masters, right? In other words, they have the power to take over your life. Correct, yeah. correct. They have a power, each deity has the power to influence one to the, to the point that you will worship this thing. Right, right, right. Mm -hmm. You will be in high pursuit of this thing, right? That's why the Most High said, if you hunger and thirst after righteousness, you shall be filled, right? Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a certain hunger level in order for you to achieve Yah. It's a certain thirst level that you, it's necessary for you to achieve Yah to the point that you're so hungry and so thirsty for him that you won't let nothing deter you, right? This type of hunger and thirst will, will, will put you in, in, in line with loving the most high with all your heart, mind, soul, yeah. and strength, Come on, yeah. which is completely necessary to pursue him to the level that you're able to tell yourself, no, I'm not going to sleep with them right. even though you're attracted to them. Right. No, I'm not going to fight them even though you heck are mad at them. Right. Right. No, I'm not going to cuss you out even though you can cuss like a sailor, Right. You have to achieve a hunger and thirst level to the most high that you're such in high pursuit of him that no matter what come or go, it's not going to deter you from him. Yeah. Well, money has a way, come on somebody, of doing exactly the same thing. I kind of understand why he called it a master. Uh -huh. Listen to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't sleep, can't sleep, can't sleep. Got to pull it on. Got to pull it on. Can't sleep. Can't sleep, got to creep, I got to get it. I'm on a paper chase. Listen, listen, money causes people to turn on one another. Right. Causes people to kill one another. Yes, listen. Sir. Yes, sir. Causes people to kill, steal, and destroy. Yes. 
causes a beautiful woman to take her body. The more beautiful she is, the worse off she is. Because she's willing to pop it and lock it and twerk it and twink it and spin it on a pole just to get some money. She wants she want you to shove some money in a G-string. Come on, talk to me. She'll let folks lay on her. She'll let folks lay on her that she wouldn't even normally talk to. She want to have nothing to do. Some of these folks is nasty. Prefer they stink. They nasty and filthy. She got to get a sanitation wipe to wipe their lap. Oh, yeah, it's the truth anyway. She has, she got sanitation wipes in her purse. Don't you talk to me like that. That She has sanitation wipes before COVID ever hit. Don't, don't play with me. And she wiped old bro up. She wouldn't even talk to him but before, because the love of money. The love of money is the root of all it. The love of money morals out the window. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, somebody. Folks is on a paper chase. So I understand clearly why the Bible is teaching us that you can't serve two masters. He said either you're going to love the one or hate the other, or you're going to despise the one and cleave to the other, but you can't serve both. There's a clear a, 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 a distinction between the two, and, and you gotta, you got, you gotta, you gotta choose. Listen, listen, listen. So then he went on to describe your escape. He said, "Okay, don't be tripping off your life like that, right?" And and, and the example that we got in the Torah, listen, is when when Egypt when when when, when Yashorel was in Egypt, and they had. Things supplied to them because it was in the land of Egypt. They, they, they had things supplied to them, right? But they were slaves. They were mistreated and they were slaves, right? But 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 things were supplied for them, right? <laughs> what he did was he rescued them from Egypt, got them in the wilderness, so now he's their supplier. Right, they they can't go get what they want no more. It's not it's not the lust of the eye, the lust of the flesh, and the pride of life. Nuh-uh. It's I got to depend on Yah. They were very uncomfortable with that to the point that they began to complain and wanted to go back to Egypt because they were used to getting things on their own. To the point that they didn't even care about the torment. They didn't care about what they had to give up and how they were treated. They were more interested in, in, in having uh, the ability to pave their own path, see their way out, see their way through. And the Most High was trying to get them to get off of that and to get into him. Yeah, yeah. And he was going to save them, both physically and spiritually. More in this sense, more physical because the Ruha haven't been given yet. It wasn't the conclusion of the matter. So his uh, type of salvation for them was land. His type of salvation for them was the fruit of the ground. His type of salvation for them was more natural, which was a shadow and a type of him being able to do that for them spiritually, eventually, when the word will become flesh. When the fullness of time was come, Yah sent forth a son made of a woman, made under the law, Galatians 4 and 4. Well, that time hasn't come yet, so he was dealing with them naturally. Are you with me? But the key was to get them to depend on him. So when we go back to Matthew 6, listen, we go back to Matthew 6 at, and 24 when he's making the difference between the two. Listen, he says, so don't worry about your life, right? I got you. Then he began to give them examples. Like I got the lily of the field. Look how they dressed. Look at how beautiful they are. He said, even Solomon wasn't dressed on that level. And I dress them, and they ain't got no job. <laughs> mm -hmm. they, they, they don't have no computer, laptop. They're not, they not going to work. They're not flipping burgers or nothing. They're just sitting there. they just sitting there look good because I did that for them, right? Mm -hmm. And then he said, even the birds, even the birds, you know, they, don't, they, ain't, they, ain't, got, they ain't got nothing. they just flying around chirping, singing to me. Mm -hmm. And they got a reason to sing because I'm taking good care yeah, of them, right? Good care. And he said, aren't you more valuable than the lilies yeah. in the field and the birds in the air? Listen to what he's yeah, saying, right? True. He said, he said, he said, so why are you tripping off? Why are you in high pursuit of that when your life ain't even right? Listen, you, 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 you still, you still got some lust to deal with. You still a liar. You still, you still a crackhead and a dolphin. You still stingy as heck. 
You still funny style. You got folks that's trying to follow me. They in and out, and he can't depend on me. He can't use you. You can chalk that off the lip. Now you just trying to be saved that he don't kill you. You might have to sign up with please just don't kill me package because you ain't finna do, you ain't finna bust, bust a grape being in and out, in and out, up and down, up and down. Double minded man is unstable in all this way. Some of y'all need to catch on fire. I wish somebody's soul would catch on fire. Catch on fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you can become uh, consistent. But listen, so what he's doing now, he's trying to get us to trust him. Then he concluded, he came on down, right? He said, okay. After he broke it down, he said, first seek the kingdom of Yah. First seek. First, look, is that a suggestion? It's a command. It's a, if you're going to leave, I'm telling you now, he showed you what you was up against. He showed you you was up against money or him. And money answered all things, and what money represents is your life. Money represents I get to do what I want to do, when I want to do it, where I want to do it, and why I want to do it. And the more power you get in that, based on the more money you got. The more money you got, that's the more, man, rich folks ain't tripping off what you think or what you say. Look at Fauci and them. They got all that money. They making all that money, often vaccines and all that. What's the name of their company? On the stock exchange? Anyway, I forgot the name of it. Um, they got Johnson & Johnson. No, I'm talking about the company that's behind it. Yeah. The what, what, company. What, whatever the name of the company is that, 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 that owns all these vaccine stuff they're doing. Hey, them boys got it's paid. Yeah, they them got boys, it. they not tripping off what you're talking about. Y'all going to deal with them. But, 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 but money represents... The power of the words, you ain't tripping off with nothing to nobody say. And they got money, that they ain't even tripping off what y'all say. They got so much money that they got from Lucifer, right? He's the one that gave them the power. Gave them the power. I don't know what you're saying. Not in the camp. Yes, I am. Gave them the power. I'm sitting right in front of it. Gave them the power. Listen. Gave them the power to get wealth. Mm -hmm. It was Satan that gave them that. Bottom line, the devil is the one that gave them the power to get wealth. They signed a blood con. The, 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 I ain't gonna go too deep into that. Listen, but 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 when you have money, you your own god. You at least you feel. So what he said was, first seek ye the kingdom of Yah. That's the command. First, but he promised you something. Then these, all these other things will be added. Look at here. Look at here. The devil do not have more than Yah. The earth is Yah's. The world and they that dwell there in that. The cattle on a thousand years, hills belong to him. Everything was created by him and for him, Colossians says. He owns it all. What happened was, Adam, the first Adam, uh, forfeited the keys to Satan. Well, the second Adam snatched it back. And those things are for his children. The wealth of the wicked is laid up for the just. When the smoke cleared, his children going to have it all. We're still in the smoke, y'all. And we're still going through the transformation process. And the times we're living in is going to get tougher and tougher and only those that is hungry enough and thirsty enough for him is going to make it through this next phase. What we thought life was about, we're finding out it is not. You opening corporations and you getting money, you setting up businesses. Hey, in 1933, uh, the Ashkenazi Jews stole all the money, took the gold. Out of Fort Knox, the Fort Knox is empty. And then they came with our end notes, which is worthless money. They been hijacked this place. They been sold this place out a long time ago, but they're slow and patient in their processes. Because how can 1% conquer the world? It's methodical, it's slick, and it's a slow process. All the way down to uh, 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 the, the revelations disclosing about a third of the world is going to get killed. Mm -hmm. How? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
where they got a medical sign with the Baphomet pole uh, uh, that represents a, a winky with two snakes wrapped around it. That, that, that comes from Baphomet. That is the medical system sign. Same sign that they're using to stick you in your doggone arm. This place has been hijacked. It's been hijacked because the wickedness of this place. It's been hijacked because the wickedness of what they did to his children. Yeah, but even his children themselves. He said, if my people, which are called by my name, will humble themselves and pray, seek my face and turn from their wicked way, then will I hear from heaven. I forget their sins and I hear their land. And only then. So the heat is being turned up because what we thought life was about. We thought life was about the NBA, the NFL. Come on, somebody, the UFC. We thought life was about the big house and the boat rides and all that. A boat full of, of crackheads, a uh, 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 dope fiend, a uh, uh, fornicating, perverse, sexually sick, pole swinging. Uh, anti yah satanic, luciferian type people. The club is full of it. The restaurant is full of it. The all you can eat is full of it. The chocolate fountain. You got the strawberry. You got a you got a devil. Come on, somebody. You got a devil with a strawberry in the hand with the with the strawberry get up under the chocolate fountain. <laughs> At Disneyland, as opposed to seeking yah, as opposed to. Pursuing a, a reconciliation with the creator. They're pursuing a happiness. They're pursuing houses and cars and land. And, 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 and we've, been, we've been baptized by the power of the prince of the air. Into believing that life is about trying to be successful with physical stuff. When you spiritually bankrupt. Spiritually wicked. Truce breakers. Funny style. Hate those that are good. Come on, somebody. Don't want to hear the word. You messing up my high. You come to mess up. You trying to mess up. You trying to run my man off. <laughs> a word coming, trying to trying to get my 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 my, my this, this this little sugar mama over here to keep her skirt down. The devil is a lie. Word come and it's an interrupter. And folks don't want to be interrupted. But you need to be interrupted because you headed towards destruction. They didn't stop spraying Kim's trails around this joker. Why? We, are we expecting company? Uh, All they got to do is put you in the house. Right All they got to do is say, it's for your good. Go in the house again. Mm -hmm. We trying to protect you. And the next thing you know, there's troops in the, in the streets. Mm -hmm. Why in the world is the president of China saying America's got too many guns? Right. When the virus came from China. Right, 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 right. right. And they just passed a... Uh, uh, a uh, 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 Asian uh, hate law. Yes, yes, They've been beating us down, shooting us, sicking dogs on us, stomping us, killing us, uh, race hanging us, uh, 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 redlining us, and we ain't got nothing. Now all of a sudden, they, 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 <laughs> you you bump into one of them, a couple of them. And now it's a it's a hate law, but and the virus came from there, and the president wanted to know uh, over in China why Americans got so many guns. They say he said they got too many guns. Why would that got to, what that got to do with him? And unless it's true that they, they did buy about eighty percent of this they country, they did. And, and this country is in debt to them. Correct. And all you gotta do is get put in the house, and you turn around, they all in the state and took over the place. Look like somebody on the top working with them. If you ask me, the the, the, the Anglo-Saxon got defeated. Trump, they defeated him. And he, they complained about being cheated. That could be true too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they could they could have stole the election. That could be true too, but they ousted him. You got some little, little, little fashions of, of, of folks that want to rebel and fight against it, and I get that. They understand that they've been hijacked. Right. Come on, somebody. They've been hijacked. The army ain't protecting this country. Not at all. Because if, if the army was protecting this country, you never would have got locked up in your house. Thank you. Thank you. If, if, if the army was working for this country, you wouldn't have been in the house locked up. So now every man for himself. That's why he's saying y'all got too many guns. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. I don't see no chemtrails. We expecting company? Come on, somebody. But because of the wickedness, because of the sins of this country, Babylonian has fallen because of the wickedness. But only those that are believers. Come on, somebody. Israel is still his children and he waking them up. And everybody else can get it that believe. 
This is way deeper than the skin tone. Come on. Right. This is way deeper than uh, nappy hair. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. We're going to tell the truth. <laughs> they had nappy hair. <laughs> they from Africa. They had black skin. They've been hijacked from the truth of that. But that's not the predication of salvation. Is he going to turn back to his children? Yeah. What his children got to do? Repent. Hey. If my people, which are called oh, by my name, right. will humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their yeah. wicked way, then will I hear from heaven. I forget a sin and I hear their land. Oh, you got oh, folks trying to make it with money. Your money pairs with you is what he told that other dude. Oh, that dude wanted to uh, uh, buy the ability to lay hands on folks. They received the rule of Hakadah. <laughs> Peter looked at him and said, man, your money pairs with you. Both of y'all get up out of here. Right. Oh, he said, oh, please pray that these things don't come apart. I'm sorry. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Folks, after money. You need to be after Yah. You need to be looking for some repentance. Listen. And then to prioritize. Listen, I ain't finished that. The lesson is uh, uh, first seek ye the kingdom of Yah. First. Come on, somebody. He's jealous. He's jealous. He ain't going to have no Elohim before him. Folks looking for jobs and looking for money. All they can think about is, I ain't got this. I ain't got, I got to get this. Ain't. You still cuss. You still smoke cigarettes. You still a drunk. You still a liar. You still fornicate. You still fickle. You still unfaithful. You don't know how to give or forgive. And you have to what? Mm. You looking for a job? Come on, somebody. Your job is to repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. So he said first, 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 first. He said, seek ye first, first, prioritize. Is that a suggestion, y'all? Talk back to me. Amen. Is that a suggestion? No. No. Is that a requirement? No. Yes. Folks get money. Folks get funny when they cut to their money. Uh. Folk, folks don't support ministry like they should because they funny style. They not, they, look at this, look at this. <laughs> the word is, if, if the word is the most important thing to you, that would be the first thing you do. Real talk. You got folks, I told y'all before, you you got folks get mad when they hear a lesson like this, but they're the same one that go to a restaurant and spend four, five hundred dollars. When it comes to ministry, they'll send 20, five, mm -hmm. 10. But they'll go to a restaurant, literally, and then tip. They'll spend four, five hundred dollars and then <clears throat> tip 20%. Yeah. Yeah. They won't even tip the house of yeah, 10%. Right. 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 Gratuity ain't even 10% no more. It's 1520. Yeah. 1520. And they'll do it happily. When they come to Yah, they like, oh, I. <laughs> and he said first. Right. He said first. What the word invaluable? See, people's expectation is they can starve the house of Yah out, and the joker's still gonna preach. That's He's still right. gonna teach. Yeah, yeah, you gonna preach, you gonna teach. I ain't giving you nothing. This is my money, and you preach and teach. And then they gotta have enough nerve to say you need to get a job. This is my job. This is the preacher job. And it's one of the hardest jobs on the planet. Oh, yeah. It's one, if not the hardest, dealing with people that sit up there and look at you like you begging. You work, look at your boss like he... Right. <laughs> How'd you like your boss to look at you like you begging? What you begging for? I work here. You better get up out of here. You begging, asking me for a check. You better get up out of here. If the man... Oh, come on, somebody. If you really, if you, if only you knew, ha, 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 ha. come on somebody, if you first seek the kingdom, you'd come witnessing, you'd be calling in, you'd be studying and show yourself approved, you'd be faithful to your post, we, it, it, you can't build a ministry for Yah when you're in and out, but the cold part about it, you're going to pay. If, 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 if the preacher and the watchman is a good one, they love you regardless. And they'll preach to you regardless, even though you wicked in your heart. You wicked in your heart and you ain't right. Nor are you doing them right and the Most High going to judge you for that. You're supposed to first seek the kingdom. Most High had a problem with people sitting in their sealed houses, right? They sit in their sealed house and he said, the house of Yah lay waste. That's because all their money is going in their houses and their stuff. And then they want to look at the house of Yah like y'all begging. Oh, well, Paul, Paul made tent, you joker, you. Paul, I been stuck. Paul was a tent man. You joker, you. So you going to discredit the work that the man of y'all do? The one of y'all do? And you want to say because Paul was a tent maker? Are you serious right now? I won't even address what the man of y'all or the woman of y'all really do. 
which is way more or equivalent to Paul than anybody else. It's a lot going on. But for you to have that state of mind to try to justify your wickedness and your unwillingness to seek first. Y'all listen to this. What you going to do when this place get destroyed? What you going to do? They bought up all the fields, right? They done bought up all the fields. They plan to starve you. They got, what, three and a half years in the tribulation? How about 42 months, whatever it say, but they, they got a certain amount of time to crush this place and to attempt to wear out the saints. What you going to do when you can't go to the grocery store? Oh, you're going to be looking for the man or the woman of Yah then, ain't you? You're going to be crying out to Yah with your stingy self. I'm talking today. Come on. I'm pretty with your stingy funny. You can't even give 10%. Give you a dollar? Nah, I don't need this dime. Give you a hundred? You can't give ten dollars. Give a thousand? You can't get a hundred. Wicked. But you, but you'll give gratuity at the restaurant. Mm -hmm. You'll demolish a thousand dollars going and doing what you want to traveling, and because when you're on the road, you be spending way more than it costs. Mm -hmm. You got folks going to the music park, fifteen dollars for a dog on uh, seventy-five cent soda. Oh, they they, they 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 run around with bun cakes and what you call funnel cakes. And ain't nothing but a bunch of whipped cream on a little thin, uh, 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 30 cent little piece. $25 for that yeah. joke. With little chocolate sprinkles on it. Yeah. And then look at the house of y'all like you want my money. Mm -hmm. How dare you? If you really look at the hearts of people, people don't be right. Want to look at the house, at the, the things of Yah, like you want my money. Yah's trying to save you from the wrath to come. And have you not been poisoned by the power of the prince of the air? That, and, and he deified and caused money to be a god to you. You guard that god from Yah and his work and his house. And the Bible says, muzzle not the mouth of the ox that tread out the corn. Jokes was so wicked that they would use the ox to tread out the corn so they could plant and eat. Mm -hmm. And they put a muzzle on him so he couldn't eat while he was doing it. Right. Mm -hmm. They just want to use him. Yes. He's just a dumb animal. Mm -hmm. Plow, you strong dummy. Mm -hmm. Pull this thing because we need to eat. Mm -hmm. Oh, he eating some. Somebody get a muzzle. <laughs> That's my corn. Yeah. It's my money. Mm -hmm. Giving that choker. Now kill him. We'll get another one. Oh, he greedy. Oh, Come on, somebody. Yeah. And he's the reason you eat. Come on, talk back. Yeah. 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 And he's the reason you eat. Yeah. First, seek ye. Is that a command or a suggestion? Yeah. First. Yeah. Got to. First, seek the, first seek the yeah. kingdom of Yah and his righteousness. Yeah. Folks want Yah without the righteousness. Yeah, without the lifestyle. Without the responsibility. <clears throat> Did you know it's a responsibility to what I do? Yeah. Yeah. Did you know there's a responsibility? Whether things are going good or bad in my personal life, I have a responsibility. Yes. You got jokes, anything go good in their blood, they gone. Mm -hmm. they'll, be, they'll be back to see me when they get ready, but they gone. Right. Don't get a check, they really gone. <laughs> been, been two and three and well, 60 and 80 and 100 dollars and me to death. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as they get that check, they gone. When the next time I see them, they broke again. Look, looking for some gas money or mm -hmm. looking for, Yeah, that's how it works. Mm -hmm. But when they get that stuff, they gone. Come on, somebody. You supposed to first. I'm a I'm a, I'm a digress, y'all, but listen. Not it's a command to, to, to seek y'all first. And he ain't even ego tripping. I'm gonna tell you what he's doing. He's trying to protect you from you. If you do not love him with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, it gives room for you to love something or someone else. And if you want to know where Adam went wrong, he messed around and loved his wife more than he did Yah. Teach. That's where he went wrong. Before his wife came, he went. He didn't feel no. He ain't never felt no love like that. So it was easy for Yah to be first. But when he met her and built that relationship with her. That relationship came more important to him than his relationship with Yah. And that's a no-no. When you're saved for real, and you're going to have to be saved for real in order to make it in this next, next leg of the race. Because right. you got to know the stuff they're trying to stick in you. Uh, 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 it, not only is it supposed to be the mark of the beast, but it's supposed to kill you <clears throat> in a certain amount of time. Yes. 
So they need to get it. They need to get it in as many people as they can. Why they can before the truth come out on what just happened to you. Tell it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if they lock you in your houses and try to go door to door and stick it in you, you end up in your house dead. Then the people that bought this place can come on over with no resistance. That's why it's a problem why they got so many guns. So now they finna go after the guns. They finna start marketing and promoting all these shootings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they gonna blame it on guns. Right. They don't market the problem how many stabbings there is and try to ban knives Correct. because there's a pr appropriate use for knives. Correct. And we, and they're fine with that. Mm. Uh huh. There's appropriate use for guns, and one of them is to protect us, protect protect the people from them. <laughs> so you got a little more protection if you got some protection. But if they can show you how bad the protection is, you'll give it up. And when you give it up, you gonna wish you didn't. All you got to do is look at history. Every time they gave up their weapons, they came on in. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Came on in. No, that's the truth. Yeah, you got to sit there and watch them rape, rape your wife, mm. rape your daughters, and rape you. Go up in you. Big old homosexual going up in you. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. yeah. They, they won't go to bed with you. You <laughs> thought they was looking at your daughter. They was looking at you. Right. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Oh, my God. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, these are the times we're living in. It's the time of wrath. Yes, yeah. it is. Folks trying to get comfortable and, and neglecting Yah in the process. He to seek to save his life is going to lose it. That's why he told you, first, you got to love me with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, and you got to seek me first because yeah. I'm your very life. I'm the air you breathe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In him, you live, move, and have your being. What he says. You going to turn on that? Mm -hmm. You need him. You better wake up because it's going down. The reason why I preach like I do because it's going down. I ain't trying to make friends. You ain't got to be my friend. And I ain't, I'm not afraid of offending some stingy, funny style people anyway. I'm trying, I'm trying to get them saved. I'm trying to get them to change, to reprioritize why you got time. Some folks are on a paper chase. That's what you're going to do. And that's why the Bible called it a master. But you better understand this. You can't serve both. Either you're going to continue to be funny style and stingy, I ain't got it, I can't. But you do everything you want to do. Y'all just ain't nothing you want to do. Not on that level. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You better teach. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm a good man of y'all until it come to money. No, people brag on me until it come to money. Then they start looking at me side-eyed, right? <laughs> joker you. You know that's Satan. <laughs> you joker you. They brag on how I live. Real talk. They bring how I live and the word I know and the word I preach and all that. What's up with your giving? Now they look inside. <laughs> Paul was a tent maker. He had a job. You joke to you. It's all right. Yeah. You gonna pay for it. That's all. Yeah. The wrath is here, y'all. It ain't even coming. It's already it's here. here. It's here. Yeah. This place has been conquered. You ain't knowing. How foreign, how do shorter than Prince gonna sit up there and look like he playing doctor, tell you that he gonna stick you and all your family, <laughs> or you can't come outside and you can't come outside? How that happened if you had an army and some rights? How this place been conquered? You don't even know it. They they threw the president out and, and, and threw threw this other cat up in there because he worked for them. Right. Yeah, this place is sold out. It's the truth. I don't care if you believe me or not. Right. And now they come with another. They ain't going to stop mm -hmm. until y'all stop them. And y'all ain't going to stop them because you need a whooping. Yeah. Some folks going to die because they wicked. Yeah. And he's telling his children right now that believe, first seek ye me. Come on with it. Yeah. Tired right. of being second. Now you finna pay for it. That's right. Bro. Yeah, you signed right. with perversion. Yeah. Church, church. Uh, 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 marrying, marrying men and women, men and men and women and women. That go directly against the word. Yes. They, they sided with, with with the world over y'all, oh, and they supposed to be the ones representing y'all. Correct. Same jokers that opened it up. Supposed to be a separation between uh, the church and state. They don't want to open up, let the state in with needles and stick all this y'all's children. Oh, they gonna pay too. Mm, they gonna pay. Yes, they are. Changing folks. A DNA say uh, the, the the return of the Son of Man will be like in the days of Noah, and they was doing DNA changing and splice gene splicing, and there was giants in those days. Yeah. And, oh yeah, 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 yeah. It was all yeah. twisted. 
You think you think that them goat head uh, statues and all that type stuff? They was doing that type stuff back then, and now they're doing it now. Yes. They do it. They're doing this trans human there transformation is, is. right now. You trans, thought it was innocent when they started replacing knees and hips. Mm -hmm. They trying to make the bionic man, right. and they trying to get eternal life through science and technology, right. which under which really is a platform for Satan to work. Come on, somebody. Tell it. Yeah. Tell yeah, it's the truth anyhow, whether you believe it or not. But the Most High is going to mark his children for. He said, wait a minute, let me mark mine in the forehead. Didn't he say it? Yeah. He said, wait a minute, before everybody get marked, before they get their mark, let me mark mine in the forehead. And it ain't going to be no mark in the forehead like that. It's going to be, he going to mark you with the Ruach HaKadet. Yes. He going to mark you with the word. Yes. <laughs> he going to mark you with the mission. Yes. You going to know better. Come on, somebody. Yeah, yeah. You ain't going to fall for the okie doke. Nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me mark mine. Let me, let me, yeah. let me, let me lay hands on them. Yeah. Let me mark them. They gonna stand against the devil and what he coming with. Yeah, it's the truth anyhow. It's the truth anyhow. Come on, somebody. We gonna stand up. We gonna cry louder. We gonna spare not. Yeah. We ain't scared of no devil. Come on, somebody. I'm with Yah. Him being for us is more than the whole world being against us. We gonna preach and teach the truth, and I don't care who like it. The numbers can stay down. How many people? He eleven. Come on, somebody, are you serious right now? Folks don't like the truth, but it's good. We're going to keep preaching this. We ain't winning no popularity contest. And I'll continue to preach to stingy folks that don't like to support ministry too. That's exactly what I'm going to do because the, the most high is my refuge. He's my supplier. Come on, somebody. Yes. And, and then I, I came up a super big giver. 10% was nothing for me. Still ain't now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And folks that know me know it. You got to get up early to give me. <laughs> Real early in the morning. Yeah, yeah, and get your little checkbook out. Come on, somebody. <laughs> get your little piggy bank. Get it, crack him. Hit the pig on the back, crack and open him up. Yeah, because, because we should first, I'm done, y'all, but first, first seek ye. Any accusations on me? First seek ye. <laughs> I teach you how to give. Come on, somebody. Yes, sir. Yeah. The design. people of Yah should support the house of prayer minimum. You, 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 minimum 10%. Minimum. Right, 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 right. Minimum. Yeah. 10%. Dollar. I give a dollar. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Folks, tithe on every nine men. Yeah. That ain't that ain't tithing. That ain't 10%. And, and look, no, and I'm not preaching the law either. Not at all. Abraham and them gave 10% prior to the law. I'm not preaching law. I'm preaching principle. Yeah, I'm not a law guy like that. I believe we should be, be beyond the law. I believe we should establish the law. I believe we should never go against the law. I think we need to establish it because it's way better that the, 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 the spirit of Yah being on stone is way better being written in the tables of your heart. Remove the stone that it was on and be baptized inside of us because it's Yah himself baptizing himself inside of us, leading and guiding us. What's better, the one that said it living inside of you or him saying something and putting it on stone? You tell me, which, who going to live better? Someone that got a stone, Ten Commandments on it, or someone that got the most high living inside of them? Giving them the power. Giving them the power to get out the bed, to tell the truth, to love, to forgive. Yeah. Somebody asked you to go a mile, willing to go two. Come on, somebody. Willing to give the coat off your back. Mm -hmm. Ten Commandments don't do that. Right. But, the, but the spirit that was on the stone do. Mm -hmm. And he's baptized inside of his children. Come on, somebody. Right. First seek ye. Come on, lady. I'm finna get out of here, y'all. Let me read it. Look what it says. It says, it says, first seek ye the kingdom of Yah and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. He the one going to take care of, when, 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 since they bought up all the fields, that's just another way they're going to starve you to death. They plan on killing everybody that don't uh, uh, cooperate, period. Bottom line. What, that president over there, there was two brothers over there in Africa that withstood them. They're both dead now. Both of them. They killed both of them. Who? Uh, no, 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 no. I'm talking about two brothers. Haiti, the yeah. president of Haiti just died. And then there, there was another brother 
Both of them was holding out and was not cooperating with the vaccine. Correct. And they both dead now. And then they turned around and said, now they're going to send 150,000 vials of vaccine straight to Haiti right now. Because they just killed the president. They did. That's how they get out. Right. And, and so, but the most high is allowing this to happen because it's going down. And, and those that belong to him that he marked in their forehead is going to escape this. But you're going to have to be true to it. And it's going to be, you can't be the stingy, funny style, in and out, barely saved type folk. Right. See, that type of uh, so-called Christianity is played out. I'm not a fan of necessarily the term. I'm not going to hate on it. All I'm saying is, at the end of the day, that time of religious position is played out. Yeah, yeah. If you're saved, you're going to be saved for real. That's and you're not going to be funny style. You're going to be doing what you're supposed to be doing. People should be all in to him. All in. I'm talking about all in. All in. As opposed to the type of person, do I have to do that? No, I ain't ready for that. But then don't be. You ain't all in. You're going to die. Y'all, y'all is not to be played with. And you'll figure out. You got to be all in or you all out. Yeah. A little 11, 11 the whole lump. Yeah. You, you can't, you can't, y'all don't play it. But, but, but we're without an excuse because he baptizes Ruah in us, giving us the power to do what he called us to do. Period. And if you don't do it because you don't want to. You may, all, what I talked uh, yesterday, whatever it was, choose. It's a choice. You can do it. You ain't got to. You ain't got to. You, you ain't going to give, you ain't going to give. Ah, okay, cool. You ain't stopped nothing but you. Right. Wow. Folks don't give. Think, oh, you ain't getting my money. Keep it. Keep, it. keep listening, though, huh? You want to keep listening? <laughs> if you had any integrity, if you weren't going to support the ministry, you would leave. Mm-hmm. If you had integrity, you, you, you'd rather rob you. You'd rather rob the man. I'm going to eat here, and I, and I ain't giving. Don't ask me either. <laughs> okay, that's cool, too. Right. I'd rather you stay eating. Because you might wake up one day. Hey. Right? Yeah, you got better of a chance if you keep listening, right? Correct. But you got a lot of nerve, though. But the most I love you anyhow, so do I. Oh, I'm teaching today. I ain't trying to make no friends now. Yeah. Make disciples, I ain't making nothing. Come on, somebody. Teach. Preach. Listen, I'm trying to read it. Look. Look what it say. But seek ye first the kingdom of Yah and his righteousness, and all these things will be added to you. What he told you was he got you. And that, that's why I took you back to Egypt. What they they the Egyptians were supplying the Hebrew stuff right. while they was dogging them out. Just like now, America supplying our stuff while they dogging the heck out of us, mm-hmm. shooting us in the street, killing us, putting us in prison. They just mm-hmm. dogging us out. Boy, they kill us, still get paid, still on the payroll, get a GoFundMe account. They just dogging us out mm-hmm. while we're eating their stuff. Because they stole everything they got from us, and now they they, they they barely feed us, you know, and we we fine with that. Listen, listen. So the Most High was taking them out from under their supply, from up under their leadership, and put them in the wilderness, and they, he put them under his leadership, and now they got to learn to do the opposite of what Adam did and trust him. That's why he put them in the wilderness, so they can get off of man and learn to trust him. Well, they didn't trust him, so he killed them. And then he let the children go into Canaan. Mm-hmm. And now here we are, same thing. Either we're going to trust him or not. He said you can't serve both masters. You on a paper chain, you jokers that got money, you should be sowing into ministry. You got folks with a heck of money in the bank chilling because they wicked. Mm-hmm. They'll whip out a couple of dollars and give it to ministry, if that, while they plot naturally, not knowing that your soul is going to be required of you. Your soul going to be required, and you're going to pay for that. You don't get along with that. If he was the type that first seek ye the kingdom, remember when he told that rich young man? He said, sell all you got, give it to the poor, and follow me. That dude walked away. He was a good dude, too. Until that happened, he walked away. And you got folks that they just ain't going to do it. You got folks that's sitting on stuff. Got extra cars parked, and they feel me? They got extra cars. Folks ain't got cars and all that. And they just sitting on it. They just bossing. Just sitting on it. How do you do that? You only can drive one car at a time. How in the world do you, how in the world do you got all that money and you got homeless people in the congregation and around, how do you do that? How? Wicked. Because you're wicked. How in the world the Most High bless you with $100,000 for you to do what you want? You can't give 10000 to the ministry. That's too much money for the ministry, huh? Joker you. 
<laughs> Ooh, ten thousand. You just cold. It's gonna catch up with you though. Yeah, you ain't gonna get away with it. I pray you wake up for it's never last too late. Let me finish reading this so we can go. But seek ye first the kingdom of Yah and his righteousness and all these other things be added on to you. He's gonna take care of you. Take therefore, this is the conclusion, y'all. Take therefore no thought for tomorrow. Do what Yah's calling you do. You, you, you sit up here biting your nails, tripping off what's going to happen tomorrow. He says sufficient is evil in today. It's enough tests and trials in today for you to deal with because you ain't never seen a tomorrow in your life. Exactly. Every time a tomorrow come, it turned into another today. Yeah, right. And he said, today you hear his voice, harden not your heart. Yeah. Yeah. Sitting on a bunch of zero. Oh, God. Help people. Won't support ministry. Folks come to the ministry, need stuff. I do the best I can. But if folks gave like they're supposed to, we'd have stuff to give. Mm, but you got folks that got it, they just they don't have the love of y'all or nothing like that. You, you got folks just ain't going to do it. You got folks that take a message like this and they might give a little something, maybe. Mm -hmm. But then they're going to revert right back to their wicked, stingy, scandalous self. But you're running out of time. And I'm going to call you wicked and scandalous like the Bible says. Word. How say you got the love of Yah in you and you withhold the goods? That's what he said. For them that need, that's what the Bible says. Yeah, right, right, yeah. And he calls us wicked and perverse when you like that. We got to repent from our wicked nature and learn to put him first. And by the way, putting him first is a command. And is it a selfish one? No, it helps you because he don't need us. We need him. Mm -hmm. He's he telling you to put love first, to put eternal life first. Yeah, put him first because he wants to bless you and your family. Put him first, and he'll take care of you. You wonder why you got people that are struggling and don't have what they need, and, and that's all they do? Because they never put him first. Every blue moon, they might do a little, but that's just not in their heart. But when you got folks that put him first, that really do, that will give you their last and give, and if you need, and they just distributing and trying to help, preaching and teaching and all that, he take care of them. Because I promise you he's been taking care of me. Right. Hey. I'm some way crazy circumstance. Hallelujah. And I need him now more than I ever, ever had. Come ever. on, I'm still in need. I need him desperately. Ever. And I'm going to continue to put him first. Is that all right? Y'all yes. give y'all praise. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. gave right, the homeless would have. Because it's really the ministry that's supposed to be able to help the homeless. That's the word. Folks will bypass the ministry because they just wicked again. Mm -hmm. I ain't serving no man. They, they'll, they'll bypass the ministry and they want to go directly to the homeless mm -hmm. to justify that they don't give like they should. Mm -hmm. No, no, give to the ministry. Ministry will do that. Right. Now I'm just saying oh, give to the ministry and do that. Mm -hmm. But it said first them are the household of prayer. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to do good and do right by those of the household of prayer first and the first one is the one that's feeding you spiritually that's it. yeah and the bible said count them of double honor. double honor not only honor and respect but financial honor Correct. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what the deal. bible teaches that's the deal. Mm -hmm. yeah that's the deal. or find another ministry that um that, that can help you grow and give to them mm -hmm. do that Yeah, but wherever you go, you got you feel me. If, if if what I preach and teach ain't for you, go somewhere where you can grow. Go there and give. Yeah. That was a lesson, y'all. Let's pray. Let's pray. Spirit of the Most High, we love you and thank you for this opportunity to come before you. How many know how gleaning in the truth of your word? That word is truth. Continue to illuminate your uh, children, quicken us, take us higher in you, for we need you desperately. Continue to cause us. To repent for the days is evil. This is things coming down the pike that um, people haven't seen. It can't even really prepare for. <laughs> the only preparation is to, to, to bear ourselves in you. For your name is a strong tower and the righteous run into it and they're safe. Yeah. Uh, we call, well, I'm in your name. Yeah. Call, 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 call us deeper in your name. Yeah. Call those that are not in your name into your name. Yeah. And, and bury us deeper in you that we may do those things that are pleasing in your sight. And that we may be used in these last and evil days as vessels of honor and not dishonor. And we'll be careful to give the praise and honor and honor now forever in the matches. The matches name Yahushua. Yeah. Abba Yahuwah. Abba Yahuwah. In your name. Hallelujah.
Put him real talk. You do your. You'll know that you're blessed when you can put him first. Right. Yeah. That's right. You got four boy. You be seeing on Facebook. Folks be kicking it with big boots on. <laughs> kicking it with steel toe boots. Living large. Living <laughs> large. Members of the ministry don't even give like they did. Boss. Not even ashamed either. <laughs> I'd be ashamed if I was part of I'm serious too. I'd be ashamed if I was the type that didn't give and then and I'm posting all the pictures, all the vacations and all the Airbnbs and jet skis and just flipping the fly. See these folks flying through the air, brother. On a on a bungee cord, brother, with gold gold chain. <laughs> Got a drink with an umbrella and flew across the screen. Right. Go. Go with the wind, literally. I can't do that. No, yeah, I'm no, just, just chilling. Yeah, I can't do that. No, there's yeah, something wrong with that picture. Me. But it's cool. Right. First, first seek you out, y'all. First seek you out. Y'all push the share button. Listen, those of you that support the ministry, I say thank you. The Most High will bless you. I say thank you because you help me do what I do. You know, you, you try to lightweight helping me not starve to death. So, so I appreciate it. And um, you also supply us to be able to do a work, and, and we do. We do a lot. I don't post what we do, you know. You know, we do. We do. Okay. Mm -hmm. And those of you that are benefiting spiritually from this ministry and like to become a supporter, it's my job to tell you how. If you got the cash app, just put put in dollar sign donate to Derek. That's dollar sign donate the number two D E R R I C K. You also we we got PayPal. You can put in PayPal dot me forward slash Derek Israel, D-E-R-R-I-C-K-Y-I-S-R-A-E-L, or you can go inside of Facebook, inside of Messenger, and there's a giving button inside of there. That's how you can support the ministry. I say thank you. Whatever you do, continue to support Yah. He loves you. Uh, times is getting tough. Some of us really don't know what's really over the horizon, and it ain't too much over the horizon. It's literally happening right now. Mm -hmm. um, they're, yeah. they're conquering the earth. And they're smashed in this country right now. And that's just what it is. And the only way out now is y'all. And you're going to have some folk in Revelation say, after all what's going to be going on, they still ain't going to repent. <laughs> Folks, is cold, yeah. boy. Oh, they still twerking. Ah, they still twerking. They, they still two fellas. See. Two fellas oiled up, baby oiled up. Oh, and, just, yeah. and just two truck drivers going at it, boy. Yeah. I bet that stink. I bet that baby oil stink so after about 15 minutes. Got to. <laughs> Couldn't smell right. Two truck drivers. Two truck drivers. so nasty. Oh, it my is goodness. nasty. Y'all yeah, know. Abominable. There was a gay choir. There was a gay choir singing, I'm about to convert. The whole big old mass choir in San Francisco. And they posted a song talking about I'm going to convert your children. And they started receiving death threats and all that. And then the article took up for them. Oh, it was a misunderstanding. They didn't understand the joke. What joke? You talking about converting our children? Right. Yeah, that's just the wicked times we're living mm -hmm. in. Y'all continue to pray for one another. Y'all continue to pray for one another. And pray that the truth go forth. And pray that you stand in these last. Don't compromise. Mm -hmm. Don't you compromise with these devils. Don't you, Don't you, know. Don't you do, it. do it. Don't you let them stick nothing in no. you. Can't. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you, study. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the marks say you ain't been to buy a sale. Look like what's going on now. Yeah, yeah they shutting it down. They, they clamping down on you. Uh, fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold on eternal life. Yeah. We, we finna go. Y'all continue to pray for one another. Pray for me. I plan to see y'all back on tomorrow, uh, Monday morning at uh, uh, 6 a.m. for praise, yeah. 6.30 prayer, 7 o'clock lesson. Uh, until then, y'all be Baruch and Brock and Shalom. I'm gone. Hallelujah.